Hello everyone, welcome to part 194 uh, of Advanced Ecom series in Laravelate. So we will continue working on ratings and reviews and uh, this is the final video of rating and reviews and in this video we are going to show rating and reviews that the user have added uh, in the product detail page. Okay, so we are going to show all the reviews here along with the average rating. Okay, we are going to show at the top. Okay, so uh, once the admin approve the rating uh, then uh, rating and reviews and then it's going to display in the product detail page okay so uh, one uh, review we have already added but we will add more and we are going to display here and for that we are going to uh, update the detail function okay few times we need to update the detail function so let's open uh, here products controller at front end products controller see here are two under admin under front we need to open under front okay as we are required to update the detail function okay so we are required to call that uh sorry uh that we need to uh yeah we need to get the ratings from the ratings table i will open the database as well uh, ecom6 is our database so i am going to open the database uh, ecom 6 and here I will open this ratings so here you can see uh, we are going to uh, show these ratings like this is the product ID 1 so it's the product ID 1 and it's the status is 1 so this rating is already approved so we are going to show this rating in the product detail page and for that we need to call this rating first of all we need to call from the query okay so to get the ratings uh, for that particular uh, uh, for that particular product okay so here uh, we will uh, here write something like uh, uh, to get the rating of that product okay so we will get the rating of product okay get all rating of product okay so so here uh, we will make one ratings variable and a rating model uh, rating model must be attached you uh, yeah no not there so we need to attach here to use app rating model that we have added earlier okay so we need to call the ratings and we need to call the uh, rating with status one okay we will not call uh, the uh, uh, disabled ratings so we will call only uh, with status one okay and where product id must be equal to the current product id and current product id we are having this one this is the current product id okay and we will use the get because there can be multiple reviews and ratings of this product and we are going to convert it to to array because we want to use the array okay so first of all we are going to check uh, dollar rating so first of all we are going to check whether the rating is coming here here it has come uh, but we also require here user details because we want to show the name of the user uh, okay along with the rating so for that we can simply attach the user model uh, that user function user relation that we have added earlier okay with user simple enough we can just attach the user relation that we have added earlier you can check in rating model here we have this relation we have added earlier okay so just refresh and here you can see that we are also having the user details along with this rating okay so now uh, see uh, now this ratings of this product we need to uh, return to the detail bit file like this okay and uh, we need to update now detail bit file this one we can comment and what we can do we can just copy and paste in new tab 
so that uh, we can check here that what details are coming so that we can use these details and we are going to display here okay so uh, let's open the detail blade file and here uh, we need to update uh, where we have written this one user reviews we need to add the for each loop to display the ratings here okay so here we are going to display the ratings uh, so uh, first of all we are going to check whether the ratings are coming or not like if uh, count dollar ratings if ratings array is greater than zero then only we are going to display this rating otherwise in else uh, we can uh, simply uh, show that there is no rate, uh, ratings exist okay we will write something like uh, uh, p tag we can add reviews are not available for this product okay so check once here uh, if we will refresh uh, here uh, it will not come but if we will open some other page like this one and here you can see product reviews reviews are not available for this product okay because no uh, review exists for this product we have not added any review so far okay so now uh, now if the reviews exist then we are going to uh, show all the reviews here and we will uh, uh, show in for each loop here uh, we are having the array dollar ratings as dollar rating okay and we are going to close this for each and inside this we are going to display we can take one div here and this div will repeat uh, okay for all the ratings one by one and here uh, we will uh, call those rating like uh, uh, rating and review we are going to call okay but first of all we are going to show here the review uh, and the review is dollar rating and uh, it's uh, we are going to mention review okay like this okay so it's done and after that uh, we are going to show the name of the person who reviews this product okay it's then here we are going to add dollar rating and that uh, user uh, then we can check here see uh, first rating then inside this is uh, user and inside this is name okay uh, inside this is name like this okay so now uh, we can simply close tag here and after that date will come okay so we are going to here show the date as well uh, and that will be uh, dollar rating created at date okay created at like this okay so after that uh, we will add one hr uh, horizontal row tag as well so that we can separate every rating okay and at the top there will be stars will come uh, but first of all uh, we are just going to uh, mention that uh, that how much rating uh, for this product okay after that uh, we are going to convert it to stars okay so first check this one that how it looks uh, open this casual t-shirt this one and here undefined uh, okay uh, so uh, there we need to check here what rating okay so it is rating only now we will refresh and you can see now go in product reviews here you can see one okay one is for rating poor product by Amit and this is the date time okay so few things we need to do now we need to convert one to the star and this date time we need to uh, uh, convert into correct format some good format okay so first of all let's uh, let's com uh, convert it to star <coughs> and for star there is uh, uh, one a sky code a sky code for star 
sky code for star is 9733 okay so we are going to use this one and here instead of this uh, we will use uh, here some other thing uh, we are going to use something uh, first start php okay sorry here uh, we need to take one count dollar count equal to one and we need to start while loop a while dollar count is less than this rating uh, that we have here rating rating this one okay so this one we can end it like this and sorry here uh, we will close this go php and here dollar count plus plus and we can end it like this okay so inside this inside this while loop we are going to show uh, first span we will take span and inside that 9733 is the code so we will take like m percent uh, hash then 9733 uh, like this is the code okay sky code for star so now uh, we will remove this one is not required uh, now we are going to check once refresh there and see if star comes no star is coming right now uh, so we need to check once uh, 9733 is must be the code for star uh, okay we need to check once whether uh, it's coming here or not echo test test also not displayed uh, so uh, count we are going to give less than or equal to now check once yeah now it is fine okay so now you can see the star is coming okay one star poor product okay like this so I will go I'm going to add one more rating uh, I'm going to log in with some other user here let's log in with some other user like amit 100 at the uh, rate of u of mail dot com uh, here amit 100 at the rate of u of mail dot com uh, we are going to use other password we are going to update the password to one two three five six try once again now fine now we are going to give rating to this product like uh, give oh sorry not this one product reviews five star product is really Good. Uh, you can go over it. Okay. Submit. So we will check here in admin. We are going to approve. After approve, it must be displayed here. Refresh once again. And here you can see after one star, there is the five star rating. Product is really good. You can go for it by Amit. And this is the date time. And also we can convert the date time here. <coughs> Uh, so uh, here we can search uh, convert uh, date format PHP and you can open the first stack or flow link and this is the kind of format that we want to use okay so uh, here uh, we are simply I'm going to do like this more and here this uh, rating credit rate I'm going to use here and this one we can remove now we are going to check once and there is some issue
check once where is the mistake okay semicolon removed now we are going to check once again now it seems to be fine okay uh, so uh, we can also give the time uh, like h i s is used to give time along with date so now check okay so now it seems to be fine okay so uh, these are the ratings we have shown with the product okay there can be multiple ratings like we are showing right now uh, user reviews also coming here this is the review and this is the rating okay so there are two uh, ratings so far one star and five star and uh, there is one more we can add from some other user and let's add first of all let's add from some other user i'm going to open here like amit 200 at .com. Uh, okay so let's add it one more time log out login 200 1 2 3 4 5 6 so that we can calculate the average rating for the product and we can display it uh, there okay so that's why we are adding the multiple rating uh, so more ratings are there uh, it will look really good okay so now you can send more details here uh, uh, cotton uh, t-shirt is uh, uh, or we can write I like the fabric of the t-shirt it is of pure cotton I love to purchase it again okay so like this we can add see uh, this review will not be published okay and here the message is coming thanks for rating this product it will be shown once approved and for uh, for displaying we need to refresh here in admin panel and we need to approve this rating okay so once it are approved then uh, we can able to see it okay so see it's disabled we are going to enable this is the four star rating and uh, now we are going to refresh and you can see one more rating has come with the four star okay so uh, we can show the uh, latest rating at the top as well okay and for that uh, we will uh, make here order by id descending okay so here we can simply add order by id descending okay like this check once refresh okay and here product reviews and uh, keep ascending once still it is coming descending must be there uh, sorry where I am doing this one sorry for this silly mistake uh, see I started doing fit and trials when something is not working but don't do this thing at your end okay uh, don't do silly mistakes like me uh, okay so now i'm going to refresh and see now the uh, latest rating are coming at the top okay so now uh, we will uh, show here the average rating and for that uh, we need to update detail function once again and we need to calculate the average rating first of all we will calculate the rating sum okay so here uh, we will calculate like uh, get average rating of product we, for, uh, earlier we are showing all rating for the product and now average rating okay so first of all we will uh, calculate the rating sum uh, with the query itself here from rating model uh, we are going to get all the rating with status 1 and uh, which is having the product ID okay uh, the product ID is the dollar ID okay here dollar ID and here we are going to use the sum function okay sum function with rating that will sum up 
uh, with all rating of this product okay uh, like the product id is one so and status is one so it is sum up all the rating like i am going to show you here like if you will open ratings so it will compare with the product id and status one and all these three ratings belong to the product id one five plus four plus one it is 10 so it is going to show 10 result you can even test here once it must show the 10 rating of total rating we are calculating right now okay so now we can refresh and we can see the 10 is coming that is fine okay so the next thing is uh, we will calculate the average rating now okay so average rating we can calculate like average rating equal to uh, dollar rating sum and number of ratings so we still we, we don't have the rating count so we will also calculate one more thing here uh, calculate the ratings count here number of ratings okay so uh, once again uh, we will use this one uh, this one will remain the same only difference is this here we will use the count okay we are going to calculate the total number of ratings here we are not uh, checking this sum we are just checking the total number of rating that we will sorry that we will divide here this this one to calculate the average rating okay so now see rating count i'm going to show you that how much this must be three here in this case so let's see it's three okay so it's fine so 10 divided by 3 what will come we are going to check what will come here 10 divided by 3 and here see we are going to check here oh, no, spelling must be correct here then check 3.33 okay but we need to round off to show stars 3 or 4 okay so we can round off this one and uh, see we can show two uh, things there uh, one is the stars we can uh, give and one is the uh, uh, this one average rating okay average rating uh, we can round off like this one uh, round off up to two and average rating star we can round off completely okay average star rating you can give this variable star rating and this one uh, we are going to round off but here we will not give the two we will completely round off and both we are going to return to uh, that detail page okay it's fine so we can remove all these comments also uh, always remove these comments okay these are not required or we can check again whenever we require uh, but we can remove these okay so now uh, now let's see average star rating and uh, see uh, we are going to display in detail bit file now at top somewhere at top okay and let's refresh first of all here we can display uh, after this one uh, okay more colors before more colors somewhere we can display here okay so here uh, we will have now uh, average star rating so here once again we will take the div and inside this div we are going to add the php code and here instead of count we are going to take the dollar star this time star must be one first of all and while dollar star uh, is less than dollar uh, what is less than or equal to dollar average star rating okay average star rating that we are using there uh, at least and uh, here we are going to close first of all dollar star plus plus then close the brackets like this one and inside this we are going to display oh uh, sorry uh, here we are going to display these stars like we are displaying earlier okay so we can 
get that stars uh, this one this one we are going to display just here like this okay so check once here refresh and here you can see these three star is coming that is fine okay you can give one more uh, spacing now check once again and here you can see this three star and uh, along with this star uh, you can give the rating as well uh, that is dollar average rating like this and uh, sorry uh, this one must be display outside and uh, must be displayed in these curly brackets now see 3.33 star okay so now you can see we are displaying the star here three star and the rating as well 3.33 okay so you can even display in some other way like uh, we can simply give the title here okay and uh, we can uh, give here like this title refresh uh, so no it is not coming okay so i think that is fine don't give him it is fine like this okay so you can also give in any other way if you want okay so uh, so there is, this is one of the way that we are using to display the rating so let's let me add one uh, let me improve the star or rating okay we are going to give here rating 2 i'm going to make the change here from here okay i'm going to give here 2 rating so so that the it will come to the 4 star every rating see every rating increase now it's 3.67 so now it is displaying the four star because when we will round off 3.67 it will increase to four and if we will round off less than 3.5 then it will be uh, three only okay so like this we are displaying the average rating here and we are also displaying all the ratings uh, by the user along with the reviews okay so now it seems to be fine you can try this one at your end and if you will face any issue you can uh, surely contact me okay so that's all for now have a nice time goodbye okay